Hey guys, this is Tonner and today we've got the details of the Pestilence event and for Red Stars for Morgana, Morgan Le Fay, however you want to pronounce it. So it looks like she's going to be coming into the game on April the 13th, which isn't that far away, about five days away. Uh, so next Wednesday, we're going to be seeing her available and you're going to be able to unlock a three star of her just by getting some of the milestones. You just need 500,000 points to be able to get that. If you get only 425,000 points, you're still going to be unlocking her via the rank rewards, which is good. Now, they've made some changes since I actually, I actually data mined this last night because I'm like, oh, I'm pretty sure the mail that they sent out was wrong, which I think was a pretty fair assumption given the fact that nearly, like, I don't know, a third of the mails they send out are wrong. Uh, anyway... It looks like they've made it so that instead of needing difficulty five to unlock Morgan, it's difficulty four. And they've some for some reason decided to change the Web Warriors and Dark Hunters requirement down to difficulty five as well. Now, I'm not sure I completely agree with that. I think it was better off just kind of keeping it the way it was with the, the Web Warriors and Dark Hunters requirement and then to shift what is required to unlock her down. Um, but for some reason, <laughs> they've gone this direction. Um, I mean, we all know the reason why, but uh, so we have special rewards for the first run of the Scourge event. So start preparing your roster now and don't miss out on the prizes on your pursuit of Morgan Le Fay. In the meantime, you can begin to prepare in, uh, with the overview of how they work. So run scores, you complete 10 nodes and you get scores you get unlimited score, uh, unlimited run events, and they don't have like a 24 hour break between them or anything like that. You can just run through them. There's 10 difficulties, one to 10, uh, difficulty five plus requires specific characters. Unlocking characters. Each one will have a minimum to point total to unlock the character. We mentioned Morgan, so that make that your base target. You'll earn horseman shards from milestones and by climbing the... So I assume what this is, is saying is that the the future ones will also be three stars um make that your base target i'm not sure because of the fact this says here we'll have a minimum to unlock and then this here says make this your base target assumedly for morgans so i'm not sure these rewards can be earned in subsequent runs so you have more opportunities in the future to get morgan Le Fay all the way up to seven stars so this is basically confirming you're not going to get a seven seven stars on run one i'm pretty sure like that's that's what i'm taking from this is that you're not going to get a step uh you're getting getting a seven star from run one all right now red stars so a few people were saying in the in the um mail yesterday it said that you'll also be able to purchase her from the elite store which is true however you'll also be able to get her from the us uh, so you also get her from rank rewards to start with rank rewards give extra incentive to earn the highest score possible and the second method will be d uh, through dark promo credits as a new slot will be added to the elite store. Oh, a new slot in the elite store for horsemen. That's pretty good. Um, I mean, dark promo credits are already something that I don't think had too much use anymore. Like doom was uh, like the only character that I think you could potentially look at doing him for. Um, but honestly, I I'm interested to see what you guys, um, end up purchasing. I think purchasing Morgan here is definitely going to be one of the best, uh, characters that you're able to purchase with the dark promo credits nowadays. All right. Uh, are called Red Stars. So you've got Scarlet Witch, Dark Cold, uh, Doctor Strange, and Wong coming back. I like that they're doing this because it means that they've obviously recognized that people would have opened Red Stars for these characters if they had a known Morgan wasn't going to be in them. So um, bringing this back means that you can do that. Obviously, Scarlet Witch as well is in there, unfortunately, but at least you'll get a, another chance at Doctor Strange and uh, Wong there. All right, and then the event store closing, gold, gold phase bits going away, elite store additions, they're adding Morgan in there, um, and then they're also adding Kate Bishop, and then the weekly events, so nothing much in there. But that's it for today, guys. Have a great day, goodbye.